Hi, this is Eric with Cat Avenue. Today I'm going to be taking you through a real basic uh, video on how to open up a new drawing. Um, for those of you that are new to CAD, we have a learning series. It's a five-day course and you can sign up. I'll give you a link at the bottom of this uh, video, but it's cadavenue.com forward slash learn. So uh, keep that in mind for the ones that are just getting going on CAD. We get into some really basic things like how to pan, uh, how to move objects, um, how to use layers, and how to plot. Some really just uh, elementary uh, uh, concepts in that five-day class. So um, anyways, uh, so let's get started. Um, up here you'll see um, a icon that says new. Um, so this is really how you create a new drawing. Uh, when you first open up uh, AviCAD, you'll just have a default drawing that you've opened up here. Um, so it's really best to go up here first and choose the new icon. Here there's a couple of templates. This one is Imperial and this one is Metric. Notice that they have the DWT extension on them and that means that they're drawing templates. You can use these templates to save let's say a title block and all your settings to a template. That way you don't have to go through every time to recreate the setup. So um, let me first show you though another method to creating a new file. Um, it's called the Drawing Wizard and you can get to it by typing OP for options and then enabling this new Drawing Wizard here and then choosing OK. And by doing so when you click on this same icon you'll get a totally new dialog that kind of prompts you through how to set up a drawing and that's using this icon here. This is the wizard. Um, here it's going to just ask you a few questions. So we want to create a, a new drawing. We want feet and inches. We want fractional in this case. Uh, Decimal is good. That's good. We could turn on our snaps if we wanted to, but we're just going to leave that unchecked. Um, and so that creates this drawing two now. So now we have a drawing two and a drawing one. So let's go ahead and close this. I just right clicked on this tab to do that. So now we have a drawing two dot DWG. Now if we didn't want to go through these steps every single time and uh, let's say we had some uh, pre-configured notes here and we had in our paper space we had our own title block inserted here uh, by the way I'm gonna leave a, a link at the bottom of this email as well on how to set up a title block because I get that question quite a bit and you want to do that in paper space so let's say that you had the title block set up here uh, and you wanted to just save this as a template so the way that you do that is you come up here to the save icon and then you go to the very bottom of this list and there'll be the drawing template, the DWT file. And remember this DWT file was in the, um, the first dialog that uh, I showed you. So we can specify where this drawing file is going to end up. And in this example, I'm just gonna put it on my desktop, but you could put it in your project folder, for example, uh, is a good place for it. And I'm just gonna call this, you know, I don't know, um, startup. And I'll save it. So that way, when I open up a new drawing, if I go into my wizard again, and I go to this icon here, and I browse to my desktop, you can see that new DWT file here. Um, so this just creates a whole nother drawing here called Drawing 3. Uh, and that basically has the same exact settings as what's in the startup DWT. So that you're just essentially creating new drawings based on that template. Anyways, I hope this video has been helpful. Feel free to check out more videos. Um, as mentioned, cadavenue.com forward slash learn for those just getting into CAD. Or you can also check out cadavenue.com forward slash basics. And basics basically has all our piping entry-level videos and also there's some ducting and structural videos in there as well. 
So check that out too. And I hope this has been helpful and have a great day.